So we'll switch to our CAD. Again, we're looking at our wonderful Learn Virtual Building Headquarters. And let's go ahead and look at this from an angle. So this is the headquarters without many objects showing, but there's still some objects showing. Let's switch to the enlarged plan. And if we go inside, which we can't do in Axon, apparently my glass is not feeling very transparent today. Let's go back to the floor plan. There we go. All right, so let's take a look, quick look at plain old chair. This is chair six. We open up its settings dialog, and we can see there is an option for whether it's a detailed, simple, or or 3D is off for the seat height, which is a nice simple parameter. I can change that parameter from one foot five to three feet, and now I have a stool. So all of these different items are changeable on the fly. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to place one of the simplest objects, not really all that simple even but just place this armchair here in the plan, select it, and then go to Libraries and Objects, Open Object. And that brings up the, editing, the Object Editor window. And this is where we can make changes to the actual object. Now, first we need to get a feel for this object editor interface. And that's what today's session is all about, is learning the interface. So we understand for the next series of classes how to approach GDL. Well, first you have to have a really good familiarity with this interface that we're looking at right now. We're going to switch back to the, we're going to quickly switch back to the PowerPoint and take a look at it. 